keep fighting. That's something I've been telling myself lately a lot. It's something that I believe God's been telling me a lot. Keep fighting. The battles get old. <laughs> the fights, you know, sometimes the fights are tough. Uh, some days, you know, it, it seems like we do more fighting than we do loving. I, I can raise my hand for that. I'm pretty sure you can too. It's like, oh my goodness, why do we have to keep going and going and going? And, and, and believe me, I understand our life. There is going to be considerable failure along the way. And there's nothing wrong with that. That's actually a great way to learn and do things differently. Failure is a part of life. No one is going to be escaping that. And there are some times in life, what are the things that we are to keep fighting for? How, how do we gauge that? At some point, you know, in life, you have to just say, okay, that's enough. I've put out all the effort I can. It's not succeeding. It's not working. And I give it up. And I move on to something else. But what about those things, those situations that we come across in our lives, be it personal, business, whatever it is, mental, health, where it just seems that God's just saying, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep fighting, keep pressing. And you don't feel like you should quit yet too, but it never just, you know, it's not coming to flourishing when, as much quickly as we want it to. We just gotta keep fighting, I guess. Even though we may be tired and and we can't hardly throw another punch, you know. But it, it, it's been something that I've been dealing with lately, and I know all of us do in certain areas of our lives. There's always something we're fighting through. There's always something we're fighting for. We're fighting for justice, fighting for love, fighting for good, all those things. I understand that should be a part of all of our lives and our passion being believers of God, but then there's the personal issues that you gotta keep fighting for 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 to 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 get this in your life to 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 have this for others and things like that, you know. How do you keep fighting? What gives you your strength? What keeps you going? What keeps you motivated? I'm curious because I'm struggling a little bit, you know, in parts of life where it's like have we put in enough effort already? Is this battle worth it? And, and yet inside I feel, yes, it's worth it. And we got to keep pressing forward and, and we got to keep going. And I haven't heard God say no. Is, this, is God not saying no just to see our strength and our perseverance? And will we keep going? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't have a clue. But I know that God does test us sometimes and, and see how capable we are because I feel that in those times of testing uh, is when God's preparing you for the next big thing. Yeah, you're ready now. You press through this, you got it, you got it. Keep fighting is what's been going through my head a lot. Maybe it has been yours too. So, how do I do it? <laughs> a lot of relying on God, a lot of trusting God, a lot of crying out to God to say, Lord, if this is not the direction or the path, make it evident, make it known. Lord, if this is not your will, then let me know it. <laughs> Show me somehow, definitely. But if it is, give me the strength, give me the hope, give me the, the passion to keep pressing and pressing and pressing. Give me the hope and the passion to keep fighting. And if it's one of those things that we keep fighting for, if it's one of those times that we just can't seem to stop fighting for this cause or purpose or Per person or whatever it may be, 
that God will give us the strength. And he will provide us wisdom and ways of approaching these situations that just don't, don't seem to come to an end. But then one day they will. Suddenly, I believe. Many of those things that we do, you know, are the ones that make us the strongest. You know, many of the things that we go through in our lives are, and the struggles and trials, we may call them, are what really creates the human, creates the character of our life. So that's one positive <laughs> to the fight and the battle that we have. We can have great character <laughs> in the battle and the struggle and the war, you know. So just something I needed to share today. Keep fighting. If you find yourself in a situation where the battle seems long and it doesn't, and you don't feel like you're supposed to quit, and you don't feel like God's telling you to quit, then trust God, fall before him, throw up your arms if I have, as I have many days, and just say, all right, Lord, all right, I'm relying on you, I'm counting on you to provide me the strength. You got to do it. Not me. Give me the wisdom of the direction to take. If this is your will, if this is your direction, you are the leader. I'll do my part. I will follow. Make that evident today. And that's what I ask God. God, a lot of times I pray, Lord, make it evident that this is the path. Lord, make it evident that I'm supposed to go this way. Make it evident that I'm supposed to stop and this is the end of the road. Lord, I need you to make it evident. Make me see it. Allow me to have peace in my soul and in my heart that this is the end of the battle. That this is when I stop. It seems like there's always a good fight to be had, isn't there? There's always a road to be walked. And there's always a victory right around the corner. I love you. God bless you. Keep fighting because victory is just down the road. I love you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.